Eleven genders. Some of the most powerful sacred secrets and powerful cognitions you need to know from Paramashiva about the eleven genders. One, gender is the totality of your identification with physical body, psychological layer, physiological existence and your will about you. Listen, your physical existence, your physiological existence, your psychological existence and your identification, aham, will, in all four levels, how you feel the totality of all these four put together is your gender. And unfortunately, society does not have this elaborate true understanding because this knowledge was kept with elite. Society has only the very rough middle class mentality, mediocre understanding of two gender. And now they are coming up slowly only to the level of third gender. But actually, eleven genders exist. The various permutation combinations of your gender identification in the physical level, physiological level, psychological level and will, aham, the individual conscious level. So understand, when Hinduism, Vedas and Agamas ask you to be a celibate till the age of 21, the purpose is for you to realize in physical level what is the gender with which you feel comfortable. In psychological level, what is the gender with which you are comfortable? In physiological level, what is the gender identity with which you are comfortable? And you are conscious, self-conscious level. What is the gender with which you are comfortable? Exploring it, understand, one of the biggest problem is till 21, if you allow somebody to explore you or if you explore somebody you collapse into the wrong identification due to powerless cognitions and you build a wrong gender identity understand whether you feel oversexed or undersexed womanizer or suppressed any powerlessness or complication in the level of sex and sex, sexual fulfillment or sexual desires, sexual guilt and any problem you go through with the sex fundamentally starts with gender identification. I tell you, when your gender is properly identified, all the sexual problems just melt down. 3000 problems sexologists have created can just melt down if you just diagnose your gender, that's all, nothing else.